or workflow for changing the background of a character. It can automatically detect people's faces. The edge of the hand or human body remains unchanged. For example, this the photo. original picture is this one, here. Run through simple processing. This can be achieved. Change the background all at once, but the characters remain the same. Let me introduce its principle first. Its principle is to detect the sound again. This is its model, right? This is also a detection model. There's a human face underneath. This is a hand. This is a face. This is a person. Here are some test data. Parameters generally default to it. This is its processor, right? Just the default. This is based on the center or something else. It's the default anyway. Nothing else. Here is an image importer. That's the original picture. When picking, he doesn't need to pick the For final. example, there is no need to pick his hair. Let him paint a rough outline. Let him test it himself. Then through control map. This model uses this line drawing. Blurry line drawing. Softball. Then this corresponds to line drawing processing. That's a big model, but this line drawing only supports 1.5. So the model here can be a large model of 1.5. I will teach you about other samplers. And here, I use the prompt word that comes with its own translation. This is convenient. For example, the background I want to replace this low one background directly in the bedroom. There are windows with sunshine and windows like this. This workflow link method. E. Want to introduce it. Simple to understand. Set control that. Link out the processing of this automatic detection. Of course, he is just dealing with characters. A bit simpler. Follow the Adobe Intelligent processing I shared in that the last one is issue. more complicated. Of course, that's totally fine. To process too. this portrait more perfectly. But that function is a bit too powerful. This is completely useless. So if you just simply deal with portraits, it's a little simpler to use this one, right? If you are not satisfied with the treatment, just deal with it a few more times. He will change the background again. See his hair. Deal with him. I don't want you to worry about the edges. He handles it himself. Match or edit yourself. If you are not satisfied, it will be regenerator into a drawing car. Or change your prompt word. If you feel okay, then I can just save it. I'm just going to show you this comparison picture. This one, too. This is a comparison picture of the original Check out the picture. before and after comparison. Look at his hair. This way, you don't have to cut out the pictures According yourself. According to his own calculation, this edge matches perfectly with the image generated by the background. If you pick it, then your hair will be green or something. It's not difficult to deal with. So this tool is still very useful. Ah. Uh, you can detect the edges yourself. I also shared this on my Duana coil. You can mirror directly. Use online. Like this. Open workflow directly. Nothing to install. Just use it directly. Then drag the image here. Then right click on the mask. Because what I use here is a reverse operation, so you just need to draw down what you want to keep. Just save it. 
inverse mask here. If you don't need the inverse mask, remove this. Okay, that's it for this issue. If you want to install it locally, you can find it in my notes. There are also all the installation, tutorial. installation tutorials for this plugin. And this workflow, it's all in my notes. Notes are mainly for you to install locally. If online, to ML Cloud is now online, then you can just open my mirror and see these. Everything is installed. Just use it directly. No need to think about installation. How to install this plugin? How to download the model? How to set data? Don't think about anything. Open directly. Workflow usage. This is currently more convenient. Okay, that's it for this issue.